Hi, I'm Simon with AppliancePartsPros.com. Today we're going to show you how to repair your appliance. Are you ready? Remember, anytime you work on your appliance, make sure it's unplugged or the circuit breakers are off so there is no chance of electrocution. In this video, we'll show you how to replace the thermal fuse in a Kenmore dishwasher. It's going to be a very easy repair. should only take a few minutes to show you how to do it. For this job, we're going to need a Torx 15 screwdriver, a quarter inch nut driver, a small flat blade screwdriver, and today's special tool would be a paper clip, and also we would need a pair of side cutters. When you open up the package, you're going to get a new thermal fuse, a wire harness, a zip tie, and the instructions. The thermal fuse serves as a safety device cutting off the power to the electronic control in case if the temperature exceeds the safe preset point. The fuse is clipped onto the control board frame. If your dishwasher is not responding to any of the commands, the thermal fuse would need to be checked and replaced if needed. Open the door. Take out four top Torx 15 screws. Remove the control panel and support it with your knee. Disconnect two flex connector plugs and put away the control panel. The thermal fuse is located on the top side of the electronic control board. The two 10 wires are connected to the door switch and to the PA terminal of the connector plug COM2. Take a picture of the controls connections just to be on the safe side. Using the flat blade screwdriver, take off the 10 wire from the door switch terminal. With the light movement of your screwdriver, take off the tape and free the main harness. Trace the 10 wire to the plug and unplug the COM2 plug. Using the paper clip, unlock the tab and remove the wire terminal from the plug. Remove two red wire plug. Using the quarter inch nut driver, take out two screws and pull the electronic control out. Using the small flat blade screwdriver, open the tab and remove the old fuse from the control board. This is the old thermal fuse next to the new one. If you don't have this part, you can get it from AppliancePartsPros.com. Insert the wire with the metal connector into the plug COM2 and connect the plug. Clip on the new fuse onto the electronic control. Attach the two new wires to the new fuse. Install the electronic control and secure it with the two quarter inch screws. Connect the four wire plug. Connect the wire to the door switch terminal. Using the provided zip tie, strap the two 10 wires together with the main harness. Using the side cutters, cut off the extra. Connect the two red wire plugs. Bring in the control panel and plug in the two flex connectors. Install the control panel.
secured with a four torque 15 screws. Close the door, plug the dishwasher in, and enjoy your clean dishes. Thank you for being a part of another successful repair brought to you by AppliancePartsPros.com. For any of your future appliance repair projects, please check out our other repair videos available on our site, on Facebook, and on YouTube.